Hi everyone, in this video I'm gonna show you how you can improve the download speed for Fortnite, not only that but for all the games in Epic Games. So you might have a good internet and have a slow download speed, or you might have a good internet, a good download speed but from time to time you have a zero download speed. And that's fine, that's normal, because the process is like this, you download and you unpack in the same time. And when you have a zero download speed, it means that you are unpacking the package that you just downloaded. So that's normal. But you can improve this. If you have a good internet and a good SSD, you can improve it and make it more constantly. I had the same issue and I'm going to show you how you can fix it. So the first step that you need to do, close Epic Games Launcher, exit, press OK, then go to start, search for run, hit enter, and then search for percentage local app data percentage and hit OK. Search for Epic Games Launcher, not Epic Games, but Epic Games Launcher. Go to Saved, go to Config, Windows, and Engine is the file that you need to work on. First thing, go to Properties, make sure that Read Only is unmarked, and hit Apply. After that, open the file and copy this code inside the file. I'm gonna leave it in the description of the video so you can easily copy it. And Copy it here and save it. If it doesn't work for you and it doesn't change the internet download speed, change the chunk download to 4 or even 5. Try all the options. For me, it works fine with 3. If I leave 3 here, it's fine, at least for me. But for you guys, you might need to change it to 4 or even 5. After you copy the code, go to File, hit Save, exit the file. Once again, go to Properties and hit the Read Only again. So the idea for the read-only is that if you mark it as read-only, you avoid changes over time to the file. So it won't be changed, it's gonna stick to the same code that you just entered and you're gonna be just fine. After you do this, go back to Epic. Before doing this, I had 8 to 9 megabytes per second, now I have 11 and it's constant. And that's what we all want to, to have a good download speed and be constant. So yeah, guys, that's basically, that's how you do it. That's how you improve the download speed for Fortnite and all the games in Epic. I hope you enjoyed it and you found it useful. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Bye everyone.